Race 36, the Sedgefield Cup. Handicap hurdle, it's a 0 to 140, it's over 3 miles and 3 furlongs. It's a long distance hurdle race. Orlando Template for Vinnie Gerard is our number one and top weight. Rolling Ball for Pontypool Racing, Foynes Pickles for Davy Ladd, Caruga Blank for Thomas Rogers, Zoff for Stu Gray, Jinka Trout for Martin Needham, Soleil Davril for Obi Wan, Ring of Esteem for Thomas Rogers, and All the Way Home makes up two for Obi Wan. And number nine, the start has got him away. Over this 3 miles and 3 furlongs here at Sedgefield with the rain starting to come down. It's going to be a bit of a slog. It's going to be Orlando Template that's going to lead this. It's a 2-3 length advantage. Let's approach the first of the 15 flights they have to take. We'll skip over that one comfortably. So Orlando Template leads us. Jinka Trow on the inside. The wide outside is the Black Silks of Zoff. Followed through by Rolling Ball. The two yellow silks of Obi Wan. On the way home in Salil Dabril. Green Silk's Red Capper for Karuga Blank. Ring of Esteem and Foynes Pickles, which is the one at the rear. So, there's plenty of racing to be had in this. So as they go through the first half mile, it's Orlando Template that still leads. And he's got about a 6 7 length advantage from Zoff. And over towards the fence near side now. And then Rolling Ball and Jinka Trowel a bit closer to the fence. Green Silk's of Karuga Blank. Foyne's Pickle still out wide. Maybe one horse is Salil Dabriel all the way home. One getting a couple of reminders there. And just at the rear is Ring of Esteem. But it's Orlando Template that's got a 8, 9, 10 length advantage now. It'll be hard to be caught if they let him get away too much from Rolling Ball and Zoff. Jim Cattrall is fourth and Salil, Salil Dabriel. Plenty of running on the flat here. With only 15 hurdles to take as they get to the fourth. Slow the rear was Ring of Esteem. Orlando Template. Vinny Gerard, the top weight. Reluctantly leading. The rain wants to really be that far ahead. He gets over the fifth. And come alongside the grandstand. So it's Orlando Template. Number one. Rolling Boys in second for Grand Platterbuck. Jinka Trow for. Martin Needham is third, then you've got Salil Davriel and Zoff, Obi Wan and Stu Gray, followed through by Foynes Pickles and David Roberts on the inside of that is Karuga Blank. The other yellow silks are all the way home, still in ring of esteem at the rear. So as they plod along, still Orlando Template. His lead being shortened a little bit now by Rolling Ball in second. He's pulling the rest along. Jinka Trowel falls. Foynes pickles out wide. Then you've got Zoff and Salil or Davril. And Karuga Blank. All the way home in Ring of Esteem. Much changed. We'll skip over the six. Zoff was a little bit to untidy over it. But Orlando Template's lead's been shortened all the time now. Rolling ball closes the gap to about four lengths lower. Very slow over that one. Finds Pickle sitting comfortably on the wide outside. Jim Cattrall having a comfortable run round up against the fence. Salil Davril, the blank, all the way home. Zoff, ring of esteem. So Orlando Templates leads down to three now to Rolling Ball and Foynes Pickles. And we're a couple back to Jim Cattrall. One, two, three, four. And still getting a bit closer order. Still going over a mile, well over a mile and a half to go. Seven hurdles to take. And it's Orlando Template by that three now to Rolling Ball and Foynes Pickles. Couple back to Jim Cattrall. So as you were. Again now. Mando Templates leads down just a couple of lengths now to Rolling Ball. Foynes Pickles gets in the ninth. And over that, Zoff steps over it towards the rear. So Mando Template is going to be joined now by Foynes Pickles and Rolling Ball for company. Still got about a three length advantage from Jinka Trow as they go over the tenth. That's six from home, so with five hurdles to take and a complete circuit to go. It's still Orlando Template from Foynes, Bickles, and Rolling Ball. And that ball back to Jinka Trow and Salir Dabril together. 
outside his career, but like, I'm going to start up against the fence's ring of esteem. He's got all the way home for company. He's off just to the rear at the moment. Still our leader is Orlando Templey. He's taking the length advantage again for Vines, Pickles in second, and Long Boys third. So Lil Dirk Real moves into fourth. Duke Trail is five. Karuga Blank is sixth. Seventh in his ring of his steam. All the way home is eighth and is off. Bring up the rear at nine. So inside the final mile, and it's Orlando Template by two still from Vines, Pickles, and Rolling Ball. So they come up to the next. Orlando Template. Jumps it well. Oh, on a mistake at the rear by Zoff and through the top of that one. Loses a couple of lengths and starts to get a little bit detached. Has to be hurried along. Get back into this, but the Zalando template leads him over the 12th. We're getting a bit closer all up front now. It's out of the pack comes a Jinka Trow to throw down the challenge. So Orlando template's going to be put under a bit of pressure now by Jinka Trow. Jinka Trow starts to take it up as we come inside the fine fur. Jinka Trow from Orlando template. These two start having a run race on their own as they pull away from the remainder, which is Karoo being led by Karoo de Blanc. Finds Pickles doesn't look like he's got a left rolling ball is uh, being hurried along. Salil Davril is still there. Out wider is the green suits of ringers of the steam and soft trying to run run on, but all the way home is even a little bit more disconnected. But up front, Jinka Trow's got himself a five six length advantage from Orlando Template still plugging along. Rolling ball trying to close the gap. Finds Pickles got a little bit more. Karuga Blank, Salil Dav, real ring of his steam. But they've got to catch this leader, Jinka Trow, comfortably up front as we come down into the final quarter mile. And it's Jinka Trow leads them down to the penultimate. Jinka Trow from Rolling Ball in second. Jinka Trow gets over it well. He's got a five length advantage from Rolling Ball. Finds Pickle still running on. Salil Dabril trying to make up a bit of ground. But Jinka Trow, as they come down to the furlong with just one to jump, he's got a three length advantage. Here comes Rolling Ball and Finds Pickles. The weight will tell here. Jinka Trow's lightweight. And we've lost Finds Pickles. Jinka Trow still holds, maintains the lead as we come inside the final. 100 yards is Jinka Trow is going to take us from Rolling Ball in second. So, so Salil Dabril is the king of the sting, but up for fourth. All the way back to all the way home. Keeps me for Fines Pickles there, falling at the last. Can you see Zoff? Should be finished, but a good win there for Martin Leiden. Wins the Sedgefield Cup handicap hurdle with Jinka Trout. From Graham Clutterbuck's rolling ball in second. Only one Salil Davril got up for third. And his ring of his steam for Thomas Rose got up for fourth. And he also took fifth with Karuga Blank. Let's move on.